Hey everybody, this is just a short video introducing images in Dr. Racket. Racket has a built-in image library, which we need to call using a specific function called require. We type require into the definitions window, followed by 2htdp slash image, and hit run. The HTDP stands for How to Design Programs, which is the textbook. Once we hit run, we can use all of Racket's built-in functions. For example, let's make a circle. In order to make an image of a circle, we start out with a left print, as always, the word circle, the size of the circle we desire in pixels, so let's say 50 pixels, the mode of the circle, either solid or outline, which we describe in a string, and then the color of the circle, also in a string, which can be red, blue, pink, purple, all sorts of different colors. Let's go with red. And then we close it off with the closing paren, hit enter, and there's our circle. There are all sorts of different functions for all sorts of different kinds of shapes, but they typically all follow the same order and have the same number of arguments approximately. So for example, a square will also have the same number of arguments as a circle. We can make something very similar. And there you go. A rectangle is a little different since it has more sides. But it still follows in relatively the same order. You can also copy and paste pictures from the internet directly into your definitions window. Or you can hit insert up here in the top left and insert an image from your computer. If you go to the Racket documentation and look up the 2HTDP slash image, You can go to the module and find all the possible functions you can use in this package. There are a lot of images and all kinds of functions you can use with these images. So this documentation is very, very helpful. Now as you can see in my definitions window, I've assigned some variables to images. And as you can see in the circle image, there's a make color function. This make color function takes three values as the red, green, and blue values. Now we can get started on some functions we can use with images. For example, let's use above and see what happens. As you can see, we have the circle above the rectangle. Now let's use beside. Same thing, the circle is beside the rectangle. Now a very important function we use in the images is place image. Place image takes two images and two numbers. So the first image we'll give it is the circle and then the two numbers. The two numbers represent the x and y coordinates. But the x and y coordinates work a little bit different in Dr. Racket. So the x starts at zero in the top left corner of any image and goes across increasing but the y also starts at zero at the top left and goes down, but increases as it goes down. So let's just say we want to put this at 50, 50 on the rectangle. Let's see where that places us. It's a little awkward, but it sort of works. All right, so those were some very basic image functions in Racket. I hope this helped in any way. Uh, please review the documentation. There are lots of and lots of functions to review and lots of fun you can have with images and racket. Until next time.